Hey YouTubers, it's Tony with Mayberry Mini Trucks, and today we have a video of a Daihatsu Jumbo. A Jumbo is a vehicle that we don't get in very often, but when we do, it's pretty exciting because uh, they're unique. This particular Jumbo is even more unusual because it is a five speed, and not only that, it has very low mileage and a two speed transfer case you almost always have to choose either you want a four speed with a two speed transfer case or a five speed without it uh, in this case you get both so let's go ahead and take a walk around the vehicle there's nothing i'll just say this there's nothing on this vehicle that i can point out to you that would take away from it being anything less than in absolutely remarkable condition um it has new tires on it. Those are Yokohama Super Diggers, which we have to import. Um, you see a little rust drip right there. That's not rust through. That's just where the corner of the door touches. We have spare glass for this truck also. Um, God forbid if you ever did crack it, we do carry the side glass, the windshield, and the rear window. And when I say the side glass, I mean both that little odd-shaped window and the actual door glass. So we have all that. You can see the sides of the bed are in very good condition. These sides fold down. And I want to point out the condition of the interior of the bed. Again, it's as if nobody ever put anything in the bed. And this is 1990. So um, whoever had this just, just very, very occasionally used it and just probably just didn't use the bed. Even the mud flaps are like new. That's pretty cool. Come along the side here. Show you the door. This is a high cab. The ceiling is taller on this truck also than is typically the case. And that's the front of the vehicle. And there's the bumper. A little chalky, but I'd imagine if you were to, um, <clears throat> you know, clean it and put some armor all on it, it would look a little less chalky. Here's the inside of the door. Really good shape. Door panel's perfect. Even the little rubber under there is like new. All right, here's a picture of the dash. It has 45,374 miles, which is about 28,000, uh, I'm sorry, kilometers, which is about 28,000 miles. And this is tape adhesive. Somebody had a drink holder there. Um, here's the radio. It's the cheapest radio you'll ever see in your life. Man. Okay, it works. And there's the other door panel. <clears throat> the seats are perfect. No tears at all. Um, don't even look like they're hardly sat in. And you have extra room behind the seats. You got this little handle here. Um, you pull. And then that allows the seat to come forward. And then back here, you have these cool little things that flip up. And you can put stuff on the floor. And I guess if you had a cat or a dog <laughs> or a, you know, a four-foot iguana. 
can put them back there. All right, and here's one of the coolest things I like, and that's this overhead storage bin. Um, you can put groceries up there or whatever. So yeah, this truck is absolutely in remarkable condition. Even uh, underneath, you know, you've got some surface rust there, but that's only cosmetic. There's no structural um, concerns at all anywhere on the vehicle. Any Anything rust colored is just surface rust where the seams were welded or something like that. Let's go ahead and take it for a drive. All right, so we're in two two wheel drive, which is pretty much that's very important when you're on the road. Whenever you're on asphalt, you do not want to be in four wheel drive. It's really not good for the hubs. These things really turn a tight turn also. I don't know if you can really tell, but we're about to go up a steep hill. And I'm gonna leave it in fifth gear. So that's fifth gear right there. Yeah. And now we're climbing speed in fifth gear going up a steep hill. Which is pretty, I think, pretty important. That, oops. That um, means you have good compression. And I'm gonna put it in third because we were going like 30 kilometers. That's fourth gear. And when you get about in a five speed 60, you can go into six, into fifth gear. And the truck runs very cool and it has good heat. But yeah, everything works, even the radio. So, uh, if you have any questions, feel free to call us at Mayberry Mini Truck, I'm, I'm sorry, at uh, area code 336 337 5725. Uh, you can check out our website at Mayberry Mini Trucks.com. And you can also. Um, Check us out, uh, contact us through email if, if that's easier for you at Mayberry Mini Trucks at gmail.com. And thanks for watching our video.